capture. There it goes. Alrighty. So, last time, we got a good start in our base. There was a, a lot of progress. I do expect we'll finish building the skeleton of our base today. And then I'll focus on doing some other shit, uh, like, later. Because I do want to advance the story some. I don't know if we'll get to that today or not. I hope so, but... Why is every literally everything in my way right now? Uh, what was I doing? There we go. Connect the controller. A whale! Oh yeah, I was gonna mute the mic. And then adjust it so it's not casting a shadow on my face like I often do and then regret it later. Wow, two whales. Look at them. Whale city here. Jesus. Oh, and a third whale. Hey! Thanks for that nine month sub, Corey. What are we gonna name our child? Our stream child. Corey hates everybody, but that's not personal. It's true. Okay, there's nothing in these large rooms right now, right? Do I have the stuff to make a hatch right off the bat? Because I'd like to just put a hatch here for the moment, so I don't have to go in and out, in and out. Damn it, I don't. Okay, whatever. Let me just double confirm that there is no... How's our power doing as well? Okay, we do have power currently. You fucking losers! Oh, the lantern tree's almost flowering. Rick a dee 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 Your boy needs to build a ladder. How do you do that shit? Do I even have the shit to make a ladder? Ladder. How do I play this game again? Two titanium. Ladder. I was about to say, why isn't that working? Okay, now we can go up. There's a large room. There's another large room. So much space. Oh my god. Okay. I just wanted to double confirm that there wasn't anything in these large rooms because I, I want to try something real quick before we really get going. Oh, wait a minute. I was going to do one other thing. Mark and I had the idea that until we get a reliable source of food here, it might be smart if we can take the grav trap, which is in one of these damn lockers, theoretically. Okay, maybe it isn't. Is it in the sea truck? The idea is that we can take a grav trap and throw it out and then it'll collect fish for us so we can have munchies when we need it for the time being until we get a reliable source of food and all that. That's the sleeper module, which might be a good idea to sleep in at some point, just to pass time. I sent you two stupid fucks a snap of uh, said shot. Okay, let me take a look here. Uh, bu -bu -bu. I have a mind to put my phone up to the camera so that they can see it, but... Please. Cheers. Miss you all. Listen, ain't he sweet? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, when are you visiting, Caleb? Sarah is visiting us, us next week. Lauren's visiting us in November. It's the boys' turn. Sounds <laughs> nasty over the stream. <laughs> it wasn't just over the stream. Oh, I guarantee it. Um, all right, do we have a grab trap in here somewhere? There's our baby penguin that's still, we're still keeping in a locker. Pulsion cannon we brought along, apparently. You cannot tell me we didn't bring the freaking grab trap. All right, apparently we didn't bring the freaking grab, tra grab trap unless it's in the prawn suit, which I doubt. Whale, whale alert. Uh, where, where the fuck even is the prawn suit? Oh, it's up here. Is it in here? Nope. Got a bunch of titanium, though. Probably be good to go ahead and grab some of that. 
All right, let's check the sleeper module because I believe there's like one storage thing in there as well. That man. Here we go. Ooh, it's dark and I'm scared. That's the sleeper. Where's my damn flashlight? There it is. Oh wait, it's the fabricator module that has extra storage in it, not the sleeper. It's probably a good idea to go in and sleep though. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna coordinate with Winslow and come down there, trying to tie in a trip to see my buddy in Jacksonville too. Maybe come down by yours for a week and go see him for a couple days on the return trip. Is it somebody that I know? But yeah, that would be great. Just as a group though, we are just like the worst planners ever when it comes to trips. So if we don't actually plan it soon, it's not gonna happen. It's a thing. So we wanna see your nasty asses. Look at that dick. Okay. And this whale is just looking for food down here. Trust me, buddy, me too. All right, here's the thing that I wanted to try real quick. If I deconstruct this, what happens if I build them vertically? Or horizontally, or whatever the hell. Because we know we can do it that way. Would that be better? I think that might be better. Or, or would it? Let's build it and then see what it looks like. Oh, uh, but now that I work remote, I can work anywhere, so traveling and such is much easier. Yeah, that makes sense. I hope when you visit, you would leave a couple of free days at least, because then we could, like, go to the beach and shit. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right. All right, do we like it better coming in if the room is sideways or straight like this? Because I'm going to... I'll connect another room, but... Do you have an opinion... Are you still here, Mark? Do you have an opinion on which is like more aesthetically pleasing? Like a horizontal rim or a vertical room? Probably stay close to a week, work part of that, and take a few days off, connected to the weekend. That'd be smart. Okay. Remote is the better way to go. It's true. I love how you can see this lily pad out here. Horizontal makes more sense. So you mean the opposite of where it is right now, like the other way. Correct me, say something if I misinterpreted what you said. Because I'm about to fix it. Oh, wait. So you are you saying you like it how it is now? Because I'm going to connect another room out from it. Swim and let's see the whole thing again. Okay, let's take a look. Because remember, I'm also going to go build out the other way, too. To get a, a room above the water up there. And also remember that we're sort of like in the southeastern part of the map. So usually when we're coming towards the base, we're going to be seeing it from this side. More, usually. And the plan is to make three large rooms and a mo and two moon pools in this on this side of the base. Maybe a scanner room. We'll see. So. I love that they added the large rooms to this game. Such a great idea. It makes sense to leave it as is so you can build outward, no? Let's take a look one more time. Honestly? Oh fuck, there's a... What is that? That's new. We haven't seen that before. Just hanging out here. I don't like that big roar sound I just heard. Am I like secretly in a danger zone? Oh, that's just a cryptochus yelling at us like a little bitch. 
This is a vent garden. I think. Usually I thought these only existed in the tree spires. Juvenile vent garden. You dick. Fuck off. Okay. Nice skin. Okay, so we got a juvenile vent garden floating around, which I again I didn't know existed out here. And we'll read about it in a second. Oh Jesus, really? I'll slice you again, bitch. Take a tail slice. Apparently their tails are invulnerable. Yeah. Okay. All right, looking at it this way, I actually think that the base is going to look cooler horizontal. Let me think about that. Or will it? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. Oh my god, I can't believe I have to worry, worry about air in this game that takes place entirely underwater. I thought that whale was about to eat my sea truck module back there. That would have been bad. Air! Shit, we got an active bioreactor again. We need to go ahead and build another bioreactor ASAP. Let me just finish my active thought and then we'll do that. Oh, let's take this water as well. Give it to me. The balance is better to flip it from how it is or keep it the same? Take one more. Can't you drop in lantern fruit in the reactor? I can. That's why we slept, so that lantern tr lantern fruit tree would grow in faster. Okay. The way the large room looks now makes the base long in that one direction. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, though, you think? If I kept it this way, I would probably just build off from the sides. If I kept it the other way, I would make it sort of like a rectangle, like a four by a, a two by two rectangle, kind of like the concept base. Hmm. It's a lot of thought. The concept base was good. All right, let's just go with that then. Let's stick with the plan. Stop making things complicated, Scott. Let's just get the base built. Let's make it over here. All right, then we want to build one here as well. Oh my gosh. Well, let's wait for the whale to pass through where I was literally about to build a room. Right there we go. Is something about to attack me? These cryptochises, I swear to God. Did the room get built or no? Okay, it did. Did they connect? It did. Then we'll put a connecting room here. And there's our large rooms. God damn it. They're chomping the hell out of my ass. I will kill every enemy in this area if they're not careful. Oh, I can see the purple vents over there. And look, we got a whale swimming above the base right now. If we put glass roofs on these rooms, we'll be able to see whales above us periodically. So the idea here is that I would build moon pools in that other corner. Keep an eye on your HP today and save. Okay. So does that look good to you, Mark? That one missing quadrant put moon pools there? Mm. 
can go ahead and take off the large room from my uh, pin things, because next we're going to build the moon pools. How's the volume, by the way? Looks good. Does it sound good and every, all that? Okay. And the concept base, I put them where that far large room is, but I think that was probably, since we'll usually be coming from this way when we travel to the base, having the moon pools kind of hidden back here would be good. What does it take to build a moon pool? We should have the materials for it. So we need four lead, Oxygen. two titanium ingots, and uh, a lubricant. Got it. Right, here's the lead. Any titanium ingots in here? No. There they are. Let's go build that shit. It's coming. It's all coming together, gang. Oh man, I just realized we're about to lose you in seven minutes, Mark. Sorry, man. Okay. So if I build them horizontally like this, it's going to jut out slightly. But I think that makes the most sense to me. What did I not... Oh, I forgot to get the lubricant. Such a silly boy. Okay. Uh, lubricant. Not in there. Lubricant. Not in there. Nope. Nope. All right, let's hope it's in the sea truck. The butt mobile, rather. Oh, if you're still watching Chippy, one of the listener or viewers, realness, he might still be here. This is our uh, our sea truck vehicle, and he you can name your vehicles in this game, and he told me to name it the butt mobile. So always with the lube. I know so much lube in this stream today. Apparently I'm thirsty. Give me that sweet, sweet lube. There's one lube. I should have brought two, though. Uh-oh. Did we completely clear out the storage of the... Uh... Yeah, the, the first base that we built is totally gone, right? Okay. Thought so. I just wanted to make sure. So we're going to need two more titanium ingots. I guess I should drink this water. Vital signs stabilizing. Just double check everything one more time. Oh, there's also the quantum locker. Let's check what's in there. Don't pack it up, I want to... Oh, apparently there's fucking nothing in there. Unfortunate. Oh, yes there is. So you can pick up quantum lockers, even if you don't... Even if there's stuff in them. That's interesting. Base prime. Or do we only move from the, the old lily pad area to this one? I know the original base is still there. I wasn't sure if we completely got rid of the concept base that we decided to move in the end. Lube, titanium ingots. Okay, well, we have enough titanium to where we can make the ingots now. But I could have sworn we made enough. Well, it was on the list, right? To make four titanium ingots? Let's check here. Uh, yeah. 
I guess it... Maybe it's possible we didn't bring them? Not in that locker. Not in that locker. Not in that locker. Oh, here they are. So it's just the lube we're missing now. Did I even list lubricant? I did. Oh, wait. But I did list two, so there should be some in here, unless I used them on something else inadvertently. But unfortunately, creep vines don't grow around here. And I don't think we brought seeds for them. Yet. Golly, I can't wait to... Or get our storage organized. After we build this moon pool, that should be the first thing on us. Oh god, I'm getting drugged. No. Why they gotta be like that? The kids. Okay. Where is... The, wait. Did we check this prawn suit storage? I'm high as fuck. I hate to say it, but we might need to... Get shroomed already. Yes, I did. Yeah, I seriously doubt there's any creep vine around here. Okay, then. Well. And you don't have creep vine. You have no other choice but to go get some, right? We can go ahead and start our interior grow beds, though, too. Our exterior, rather. Where's foundations at? The only thing is I didn't really plan for, for foundations. It'd be worth a trip back to check. You're probably right. Fortunately. Where the hell is foundation on this menu? Some fucking where? Oh, it's the very first thing. So you need two lead, which I only have two, so I don't want to build a foundation right now, actually. I know I've got more in storage, but... All right, let's completely empty our inventory. Before we do anything else, let's run back here. This is going to be our storage area all the way over here. So let me also get the large room partition. We're going to build a lot of lockers. So check this out. It only takes one titanium to build these, so. Oh, wait. I think you have to have a glass dome to, to do that for... Uh, I'm not sure. Wow, it's, it's really persnickety about exactly where you put it. One, two, three. Actually, that's too close to the wall, I think. Oh, it adds to the, the whole strength, actually. What, I can't deconstruct it now? There we go. Can I rotate it from here? I think it's, it's messing it up because... That's why the video said you needed a glass roof, apparently. All right, we're going to have to deal with fucked up storage for a minute, apparently. Do we have to, though? Hmm. I 
right, let's dump everything that we have already. We can put the laser cutter up too. I don't think we're going to need it anytime soon. And the thermos, actually. We're going to check the sea truck storage as well. Completely offload everything. These lockers. Get the baby penguin out as well. And this shit. Oh, there's still gonna be one thing in here, of course. It's never easy. Then we go in here. Put that gold there. We might need to build another locker to keep all this shit. It's looking like the answer to that is going to be yes. That can go up. Uh, table coral can go in here as well. I'll keep the water on me just in case. Now let's continue emptying it. We will get there eventually. We just won't be able to build our super storage module until we advance the story some. And then there should be some stuff in... The prawn suit, the waste crisis, rather. Calorie intake recommended. I'm hungry, apparently. I could eat one of these shrub nuts, but that's not what I brought them for. I'm feeling good about the space, though, gang. Yeah, we do need another locker. So let's go ahead and build it. Whoops, not that one. I say, you can't tell me I don't have two titanium on me. All that shit goes up. You can too, I guess. And then up here. Alrighty, dude, I gotta head out. Sorry, I can't stay. Enjoy your uh, anniversary thing, Mark. We will uh, miss you with bated breath. Is that a correct thing to say? I'm not sure. Wow. Oh, almost the exact right amount of space. Too bad. I guess I can put one silver in this quantum locker. I don't want to pack it up. I want to put something in it. All right. So we've got Black Buck Friday, you fucking losers. The aquarium module can be detached. Black Buck Friday, you fucking loser. And we want to attach the Waste Crisis. Just to have more storage with us. We'll miss you, Mark. That means the rest of you jamokes in chat have to, to pull your weight with giving me somebody to talk to. Oh, God. Get in the truck. <laughs> Man, he did come for me. Chompy was up, like, he, he tried to take his opportunity. All right, before we, uh, before we head all the way back, let me see if the shrub nut tree has grown. Maybe it can give us some food. It can give us some. I wonder if, if they restore a lot of bioelectricity. 
Mm, oh yeah, so good. Such good nuts. Oh, it's got some water ready for us. That's good. I'm gonna need it soon. Thank you, water filtration machine. Hell, this needs more lantern fruit already. Do we have more lantern fruit grown? We do. Definitely gonna need a second bioreactor. Whoops, didn't mean to take that many. I can go ahead and eat this. All right, back to the original base. Continue moving all our old shit there, from there. Uh, where's it at? That way. I should rename this beacon now that that's not our main base. What if the, these guys could confuse, hypnotize you while you're in your sea truck? That would suck. It's a bit of a long trip, unfortunately. I wish I could, like... We haven't got the horsepower upgrade yet, for one thing, though. Speaking of which, I wonder... You should play the Halo Infinite beta this weekend. Have, did you uh, get to play the first beta, Chippy? This is the second one, right? I gotta say, I'm pretty disappointed in Halo Infinite, just because really the only reason I play Halo is for the co-op campaigns, right? It's kind of like a tradition for me at this point. And now that that's not going to be available immediately. I did last weekend, and then there was one a month ago that I didn't get into. So what's your uh, overall opinion slash thoughts so far? I've heard that it's actually pretty good. That's just hearsay, though. You also know that I, from personal, literal person, what attacked me just now? From literal personal experience that I am the worst at Halo multiplayer. We're almost home. It's different, definitely better than Halo 5. I think I'll get into this one a lot more again. Looking forward to the campaign. Are you going to wait for it to be... Uh, have the co-op mode added? Or are you going to just dive in from the beginning? And here we are. Home sweet home. Right, let's see what all we can fit in our gear here. Just say my base legs didn't load here. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, what do we got? Let's at least make sure we have the lubricant we need. That's not lubricant. I can hear somebody calling Corey in the background. Poor Corey. How'd this ion cube get away from me? Hey, thanks for being an eight-month sub, Chippy. Next month we will uh, <laughs> we'll be able to have a stream, baby. No, I'm serious. Everybody that's subbing today, I really appreciate it. It means a lot, man. Apparently, I don't have any lubricant. If we don't have lube. What was has this even all been about? I guess we need to make some. So what, lube, it, does it lube take the clusters or does it take the creep vines themselves? I forget. Redeemed hydrate? Oh, with liquor? Are you allowed to specify that? This one's your wish is my command. All right, so it just takes creep vine clusters. So let's... Uh, Let's grab like two of those. So we'll have a, uh, three of those. So we'll have like extra lubes to take with us. Just in case, you know. Boom. Go ahead and make that shit. Where's my fabricator? There it is. Lube. Lube. 
I would like to get into campaign ASAP, but whenever co-op launches, I'm in for more playthroughs. Gotcha. Uh, Chris and I played through like every Halo co-op together. That's like, not that I wasn't already into Halo, because I played it with like a friend of mine when I was younger. Um, but like, I never played through like maybe one, more than one of the two of the campaigns. So I'm looking forward to the co-op launching so that, you know, Chris can play together again. And, and hell, if they have support for more than two players, like we could all get in on it, get in on it. Let's make sure we take all the titanium that's in our lockers because we gonna need it. So this locker can probably be deconstructed, actually. Let's do that. Nothing in there. We probably want to take any copper we can find, too, in these lockers. Even though that those are like the two most common materials, they're also like the most needed. Alright, let's offload this ship. Sploosh. We'll put the this stuff as much as we can in the quantum locker. Which is already somehow full. Okay, whatever. Did these have anything in them? No. I wonder if I should deconstruct them. Oh wait, you can't deconstruct the waterproof lockers. I guess you would need a recyclotron for that. That would make me moist. Did Halo 5 support more than two people for online co-op? I'm pretty sure we played it in person, but we had to do it like on our own separate screens because they took out couch co-op, if I remember right. Oh yeah, we didn't actually offload anything. I probably should have put this in the moon pool. Let me go ahead and do that. Detach all of this stuff. And then let me go charge this bitch. I think it was two player, literally only played that one through once. I mean, same, but also I'm not as big into Halo as you and Chris are. Okay, so that's going to be charging. Actually, I should probably repair it. Do I have my repair tool on me? Yes. Yes, I do. Fix it. Twice a shit stain on the legacy of Halo. I didn't hate it. I actually kind of liked it. I think it had more cutscenes than usual. It didn't really make sense to me. It seemed very out of place and like it didn't really bother to continue on from the plotline of the first one. But other than that, or the, the, the fourth one, I mean. You get to have a shit ton of titanium in your innards. Okay. You can fit more, though. We have to go deeper. And actually... Should probably take a few of these ribbon plants. We have plenty of gel sacs in there. They get a couple of these spiral plant seeds. Get a couple of these antenna plants. I just want to make sure I can restart my grow bed, you know? Does the creep vine? Oh, the creep vines are going to grow from the seeds. So let's take a couple seeds with us as well. And then we can go and put this shit in the prawn suit as well. Did you get all the diglins? Dan fell asleep. Oh no. I did. We got all 151, which I didn't know there were that many, but we still got them all. Hopefully you are not feeling dizzy from your meds anymore. That's my, my one wish for you, Dan. How do I get in here? I thought the graphics, cutscenes, etc. were great, but the plot was extremely thin slash uninvolving. But I'm a super nerd about that franchise. I get that. I like that it had Dr. Halsey in it more because for some reason I think she's an interesting character for the franchise. Um, can I put anything else in here? I didn't hate uh, Cole's involvement. I thought that was an interesting twist. Uh... I guess they kind of had to go this way after the way Halo 3 and 4 ended, but 
it is annoying to me that like the entire did i fucking run out of power that's never happened on this space before oops huh interesting did it even get charged up does it say over here uh, i guess it had to charge too much energy oh well we'll be fine i think I'm good now, thank you. Good to hear it. Anyway, I didn't finish my thought. How long are we, are we gonna go with the plot of, oh no, I lost Cortana, but also she's evil now, but also I still love her. I'm tired of it. Either make her redeemable or don't. You know what I mean? Well, there's a neutral green bar in here. Oh, the sun's coming back out. We're back in business, folks. Power restored. All primary systems online. All primary systems online. Let's go offload, offload all this shit. Uh, do you have to play dodgeball today, Dan? Seek fluid intake. Oh no, I'm thirsty. Apparently. Drink. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. Put that egg in there. Salt. Really don't need the salt though. Put all that shit in there. That locker's full now. Ruby. Eggs. Probably put that stuff in there too. Actually, I should probably take the med kit and keep that on me just in case, right? No, I'm gonna just chill this evening. Cool. You have anything to drink? Or do you plan? Well, I guess you're not really chilling if you're. You can drink and chill, though. Alright, so apparently with just the two solar panels, there's a brief period at the very end of the night where the base runs out of energy here. Which isn't the worst thing, but. I'm going to leave that there for the flares. This one could probably be deconstructed. Give me that t sweet, sweet titanium. Well, we can always build more later, but... Before I take... Let me take the eggs, at least. I'll come back to that one. Give me all these materials. Oh, there's water in that one. I'm going to run out of storage space, though. I guess it's good to have my own personal inventory full, though, too. Did I bring the fabricator module? We'll find out in a sec. That's completely full. That's completely full. We can put some stuff in here. That one's full now. That one's full now. Put this egg in there. We're almost out of space. We got like, what, three spaces and then whatever we can fit on our person? Drinking is absolutely chilling, but I can't drink, so moot. Because of your meds? How long has that been going on? Sorry if you've told us about that before. More importantly, did you get all the diglins? Welcome aboard, Captain. Let's eat some of these nuts while we're here. Oh, yeah. Okay, that filled this up pretty good. I'll come back to that one. Take this water, and then we can deconstruct this one. We've got some important shit in here. Full power cell. Damn. Now we can deconstruct this one as well. Right, what's in this one? It's fairly important stuff. Deconstruct this. Oh, my inventory's full. If you recall, there were three spots left. Drinking is uh, two weeks starting today. 
Because of the mitts? Well, sorry. Uh, first of all, sorry if I am asking two personal questions. Let's see. My advice would be... Why can't I see shit right now? Apparently I'm... Wait. Definitely take this power cell for, sh for sure. And then this fabricator one. Let's just double check everything's full now. Can I just eat this? That'll clear up some space. Okay, well that makes sense. So what we're doing right now, um, Dan, we started to get back to the base building and then we realized I was missing one piece of material somehow that I needed. So I came back to ba our OG base to get that one piece of material. But I figured while we're here, I might as well transfer as much shit out of these lockers as I can. Just to have available when we need it. We got rubies, diamonds, gold. Uh, egg. There's some silver there that I should probably take. And now I think I'm full. Yep. Nice, nice. All right. And Mark had to leave. He had a, like an anniversary party to go to. His cousin's wedding anniversary or something. All right, I think that's all we can freaking pack. It's almost enough to make me want to get another storage module. Go down. I wish you could back up your caboose into the thing you wanted to attach it to and then just go. Wouldn't that be nice? Oh no, my controller died. Are those double A's or triple A's over there? Maybe it'll last a little longer. Xbox controllers die about 20 times before they're truly dead. We do love backing up our caboose. Oh no, it's really dead. Okay, I gotta go find some double A's. I know I got some, so no, nobody panic. Uh, I got plenty. I just gotta go get them. So, damn, totally dead. Can't even pause it. There we go. So I'll be back in like one minute, if that. All right, what do I? How do I get back? How do I stream again? There we go. Back to the game. Well, I'm glad you came back when you did, Dan. My buddy Chippy was having to support Chad all by himself. All right. I think we're safe to head back to base now. Our new base. Just flip on around here. Where the hell is it? Concept base. I guess if I just head this way, I'll find it, theoretically. What a waste is that today? I know he went to a baseball game last night. Maybe he got hammer drunk. That's the, that's the, uh, that's my head cannon. And he's like, has the worst hangover of his life right now. I hate those guys. They're so like a threat, but not. Not a threat, but then sometimes they are is what I meant to say. Maybe uh, he got hit in the head with a ball. I mean, that could be the, that could have happened. Good secondary theory. I actually dressed up a little bit today, mostly for him. 
I can't wait till we get the horsepower upgrade. I should have made done that first before starting all this base business. Because right now it feels like we're going at a, a snail's pace. Also, when I went in the main room to find our storage shit for batteries, Corey wasn't in there. So he must be off with his other man right now. You said maybe, and I'm like, yeah, I know where this is going. Totally baseball to the face. <laughs> he probably celebrated and got drunk. Whale! Let's follow the whale. Whale sighting. All right. I think I need to turn this way now. Actually, do I even have a beacon on me? I need to make a beacon at some point soon. Because I need to find my base. My new base, that is. Let's keep going this way. Maybe we'll find it. So far, no luck, though. What was that? Is that a whale? Okay, I thought I saw a chalicerate for a second. I don't think we were this close to everything. Has Corey managed to use the pool much this week? He got to use it for a fair amount of time yesterday, finally. Because I had to work late yesterday. I worked like a 16-hour day. Feels like we're going the right way now. Definitely need to make a... If I don't get make the control room on this trip, we definitely need to... Uh, make a beacon first and foremost. I was afraid he was going to dry up. He almost did. Are you caught up on the work yet? No. I'm close, though. I'm a lot closer, thanks to that 16-hour day, than I was. I've almost gotten past the hard part. Well, I know we put our base somewhere in these islands. I thought I had marked it, but I guess not. Hang in there, baby. You got this. Try it. I actually uh, logged in for a couple hours this morning, too, before stream. My theory is if I just circle the outer perimeter of the, these islands, I'll eventually find it. No rest for the wicked. That's true. Oh, we might have to look up some coordinates. There's these over here. The Lilypad Islands are bigger than they first seem. Do you need me to help? Um, I don't think so. Oh, I could have... What was I thinking? I could have just gone towards my sea truck modules. Because, you know, I left them there. The hell? The controller just died again. Are they not in there good? Odd. Alright, don't be a dick, controller. I'm useless at this game with a keyboard. Actually, it, the first couple of times we streamed the original Subnautica, I think I did it with a keyboard. Good morning, all. Happy Saturday, Duffy. How are you, friend? Hi, Duffy. Here we go. Our base in progress. Okay. Let's park. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. 
a little tired, stressed, but I'm happy to be streaming, especially some Nautica. Happy to be hanging out with you guys. Let's go in here. And build another locker. Just to offload what's on our per our person. Or is this one full? Yep, it's full. Eventually we're gonna get rid of all this shit. I'll keep the titanium on me, I'm sure I'm gonna need it. Okay. How are we doing power wise? Okay. It's already consumed all the power. Let's see if the lantern fruit are. Okay, we're good on that. I think pretty soon I'm going to build a, a second bioreactor because it seems like the power consumptions of this uh, base is going to be wild. All right, so for the second moon pool, we need two lead, a lubricant, and two titanium. Let's see what we can get out of there first. My favorite day of the week, hanging out here. You know what? That's why it's my favorite day of the week, too. Duffster. I know that my titanium ingots are in here somewhere. Oh, here's some lead. We know I'm going to need that. Titanium ingot. Titanium ingot. At least I thought they were. Unless I put them in the sea truck storage. But now that... Oh, here they are. Good. Okie dokie. So, now we can build our second moon pool. Moon pool, moon pool. That way we have a moon pool for both the mecha waste, sorry, the waste crisis and What am I missing? Oh, I needed one more lead. Of course I did. And the buttmobile, that's what I was going to say. You guys are just going to make me melt. I say, I know we have more lead. Oh wait, I didn't get the lubricant out of the truck, did I? Still need to do that. I'm just a working man with my sea truck. Wish I remember where I put any of this shit at any given time. I swear to God, if it's in the last one I check. And it was. It better be in the prawn suit. There it is. Okay. Now we can finish it. All right, so now that we have done that, this part of the base is more or less complete, I think. She's on her way. Tell everyone. There he is. She's not supposed to be here until nine. Driver just text message and her facial is ruptured it is. God, Why is there a people? Really? It put the It tried to support this room on this plant. That's not what I want. I woke up this morning and I just hated everything. We're gonna have to de deconstruct all this shit. Deconstruct. Deconstruct this one. Deconstruct this one. I'm glad I noticed that. Any tips to play this game, Scott? Because I've played this by swimming around to find the debris and running out of oxygen. Mm, that sounds like my mornings. My tips, Duffy, would be to focus on one-ish goal at a time. Figure out what you need to do and then just focus on that. 
So I need to build it. I mean, I could give you a whole host of tips, but there we go. So I really just need to move everything back one. Now let's build the moon pools again. Maybe. Is that going to connect? Mm, this sounds like nine mornings. <laughs> Rebuild this one. Okay. All right, so am I going to have to move the other two as well, or does it actually look better asymmetrical? Let's assess. No, I think I like it better, even. Deconstruct. Wanna, 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 wanna. Early on in the game, making shit like the scanner, um, your basic tools is gonna be most important. Swim higher so I can get a better idea what the hell I'm doing. Wanna wanna oh, I don't want it to be there. Here we go. Warning. 30 seconds of I'm busy. Remaining. Wait, I built it too high. Uh, I guess I better go get air. Got it. Oh Jesus. Oxygen. I just saw the the shroomer thing. If that had gotten me right then, I, that might have been the end for me. Phew. I move this down. My poor habitat builder's getting a workout today. How oh, can it be built there? There we go. Okay. That looks pretty good. All right, so this side of the base, there's its basic skeleton. And the main section, really. Do I want to build the, the scanner room on this side, or do I want to go the other way? Isn't another question. Let's just leave it like it is for right now. All right, so now we need to build outward. So let me, if I go straight up from here, that's actually kind of what I need. But I could build outwards a little bit more. You, you got what I need. All right, so let's let's see pin all for right now and focus. I'm gonna need some glass compartments. Mark the X compartment. That should be good. Making glass compartments requires glass, Scott. You should get that first. Get all the glass we can out of here. Of course, I don't know where any of it is. Theoretically, we shouldn't need as much glass as we needed, I needed for the concept base. Well, where the hell is it? There's two of it. We ended up using more glass than expected, though, if I remember right. Let me double check there isn't any in the sea truck. Glass needs glass? Imagine such a mechanic. It's kind of ridiculous, if we're being honest.
Please tell me I have more glass than that. That's a no. I'm pretty sure there's none in the prawn suit, so I guess we need to get start making some glass. I'm just gonna turn like all but a few of my quartz that I have with me into glass. Hopefully I have more than that. We might have to go quartz hunting. It's not in, we didn't bring any more than that with us. Please let there be quartz, Jesus Christ. Oh, here's plenty. Well, maybe not plenty, but... And we got some in there, too. Phew! Okay. Nobody panic. We're good. For now. I'll use the fabricator module to make it in here. Because we haven't put a fabricator in this space yet. Let's see here. Make me some glass. Panic. I should make that a command. I'll make it as much as it'll let me at this point. I can always build a thing that lets you... Um, decon There's an item, a new item in this game that lets you take um, things that you've built and deconstruct them, which is really cool. All right. Wow, we actually got 10 glass out of that, so that's actually really good. Okay. Let's start building. Glass. Right, how far do I want to build, though, is another question. Like out here? That seems like a long way. Which way do I want the base to face is another good question, or the top part. Which gives me the prettier view? Get up there. Oh shit. So it'll be under one of these li lilies. I mean, they all every view is kind of the same, huh? Check it. What is that? Is that a whale? Just hanging out over there? Okay, it's just a whale. Okay. Everything's fine. So, you can see whales if we're looking out that way. Oh, there's a well right here, though. What a cutie. He came to say hi. Right, I think we want it to just face inward towards the, the islands, because there's nothing to see out that way. Uh-oh. You good? Lilies and storm clouds as far as the eye can see. Seek fluid and take. You're right. Glug, glug, glug. All right, so I think we want to actually... Oh, there's a mountain over there. Wait, where's my base again? Okay, I actually think this will be good. I can build, like, uh, right above... Just build out to... Wada 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 wada. Don't want to build straight up here. Or do I? Nope, I want to build that a little bit more. Let's build an L. 
Actually, I don't want to build an ill. Because that's like wasting materials. We, I might change it later once I have a ton of glass, but... So what's about the halfway point? Like, one more out, you think? And then here, I want to build an X compartment. I like that she does. You're going to make me act up hands when you drink there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So now we can build our scanner room and our control room. All right, guys, I think it's time for the next the next command because mark was in one time keeping before so i don't want the scanner room on the left and the control room on the right probably doesn't really matter hey thanks for that follow gideon Rafaela. is that am i saying that right i appreciate it welcome to the scott spot oh is mark not in chat he had a three o'clock there you go thank you one, two, three, one, two, three, drink. Throw him back to Lalu's camp. Ah! Right, Corey's on a call. Let me go handle that. I also have to piss. Mark had a uh, three o'clock wedding, his cousin's wedding anniversary that he had to go to. So give me just a second, you guys. You want to be on camera? No, I look Okay. Corey says hi. He was ready for the uh, <laughs> the shots. To being very close to done with our base skeleton. End the stream. End of you guys. Cheers. Haha. -ha. Mark got married, but I don't even know his relationship status. He's uh he's single, unless there's something he hasn't been telling me for a long time. But yeah, it's his cousins. He was part of their wedding party, so it's kinda like and they're renewing their vows, so it's kinda like expected or whatever. Just because Corey brought the shot doesn't mean that I don't need to piss, though. So, give me a second. By the way, uh, Waste, you didn't say anything, but I'm I'm a little bit dressed up today. I did it for you. I wanted to try something different. Um, also, I'm even wearing khakis. How about that? In my own house. We love to see it. I don't know. I just felt like it. Back to the game. I'm on audio, one sec. Oh, okay. No worries. Oh, we did build a fabricator in here, apparently. Need to get some batteries back in there. Alright, let's get the materials we need. Let's see, which is... Copper, more titanium, one gold, table coral. Here's some copper. Here's the one gold. Oh, that is nice. I'm glad you like it. I got this pretty close to when COVID started, so I never really got to use it as much as I wanted. So we need the table coral and the advanced wiring. We got plenty of glass in here, so that's good. I know there's a table coral in here somewhere. At least there better be. If not, I'm going to riot. There it is. Up we go. And then... Alright, what do you guys think? Scanner room on the right side? Or the left side? Whichever side we don't pick, it's the side that the uh, control room is going to go on. Looks like I'm gonna do their whale songs. I guess it doesn't really fucking matter. I guess we can put scanner room over here. Gonna need to kind of rotate it here. There we go. That's what we want. 
And we're not going to make the upgrades just yet, though. So it's not going to be super useful. If you need fucking help finding titanium, you're in trouble. I like the I like the snark to the AI. All right, and here's the control room, which I've talked about before, but it's a new it's new to this game. In the control room, you can change base lighting and colors, rename your base, and see information about power and structural integrity but not the integrity of societal power structures. Wouldn't that be something if you could just go in there and, uh, like, all right, tell me how powerful Russia is right now. All right, I'm going to wait until we finish building the base, the skeleton of it, before we start, um, before I customize, like, give it a name and all that shit. All right, let's see. If I swim straight up from here, Looks like I'm almost where I want to be. So maybe like two more glass compartments. Actually, this is almost exactly where we want to be. I think. Yeah. Okay, I actually have an idea then. Let's let's get some more glass together, just a few more. Love a good skeleton, and it's it is spookmas. You're right. Oh, the bow reactor needs some more shit in it. Got to keep this huge base powered. Let's see, did I, when I made my plans for this space, did I include two bioreactors? I need to confirm that. Uh, bioreactor, bioreactor. Where the hell is it? I don't even see it listed here. Control, I'm, I'm looking at my spreadsheet. Bio React. Oh, I did include. Okay, so theoretically we should have enough to build two bioreactors if we need to, if power becomes an issue, which it it is going to be, I think. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I need to get more quartz. Let's take it from the C truck for right now. Which is somewhere. Right there. Yeah, I don't know when it'll be exactly. It may not be till later in the month, but I am thinking of... I'm thirsty again. I am thinking of uh, streaming a spooky game. At some point in October. May not be start to finish. May only be two or three streams, if that. It'll be fun. Right now, I'm leaning towards either Dead Space or uh... I should probably stop there. Uh, one more. Dead Space or Alien Isolation, with the possible the Shadow uh, winner of Silent Hill 2, which I have played before. Can you build a vertical connector? Wait, I need to get more titanium. I was going to ask if you can build a vertical connector out of an X compartment. Like you guys would know. Dead by Daylight? Luigi? Oh, I see what you're saying. 
I will say Dead by Daylight, I find it a fascinating game, right? I think it's a really cool game. I have no interest in playing it. Most games that are like centered around online competition, I just have no interest in really. Why do I have this out? Okay, so you can build an X compartment out of, or a, a vertical connector out of an X compartment. I don't like that though. Let's build that there. Now we build the vertical connectors. I'm saying that Luigi's Mansion is the first Nintendo spooky game I could think of. It's not actually scary though, is it? I mean, I've played, I've played one and three. I only played the start of Dark Moon because it was a disappointment to humanity, but actually it wasn't that bad. It just wasn't for me. We're gonna need more titanium. Let's go get it. We need to get the enameled glass too. DVD is something I would never seek to watch, but everyone else I watch plays it, so no complaints here. Actually, I need another X compartment as well. Seek fluid intake immediately. I'm dying. Nobody mind me. Vital signs stabilizing. I don't care about scary. But it's October. That's the point, right? Get this some more titanium out. Won't get this quartz out just yet. Here's some enameled glass. We're going to need all of that. I didn't want the salt. Still got some copper in here if we need it. I wonder why I brought this other advanced wiring kit. I'll remember later, probably. I need more titanium, though. I know there's a shit ton in the waste crisis. Looks like we just about cleaned out these lo these lockers of titanium, though. Which is fine. Oh, no, I spoke too soon. Wouldn't Metroid be the OG Nintendo creepy game? PSL is the point, he said jokingly. I like PSLs. Not, I don't like PSLs anymore. Well, here's the thing, though. Metroid Dread does come out in a week. Something like that. Maybe less than a week. I'm definitely streaming Metroid Dread. Probably just about as soon as I am able to. But I ordered mine from Amazon Japan. And so for all I know, I might not have it for three weeks or a month or whatever. I hope I hope that's not the case. I hope I get it relatively close to the release date. I'm just gonna have to like stay off Twitter and shit. Can't wait to have it in my hand. I agree. I actually might get Dread, beat it, then resell it online. If I don't, by the time you beat Dread, if I don't have Dread, you can resell it to me. What am I doing? Right. Finish building these connectors. And actually, I want to build another X compartment here, too. Hmm, I don't like how close those are together, actually. Ugh, I'm going to have to build it out further. Fuck. Damn it. Okay. That's okay, though. I can deconstruct this. Build another glass compartment. Can 
Can I build one more? Okay, great. Now let's build another X compartment. And now we can build, where's it at? Wait a minute. Shoot for the moon or whatever it takes place. Did the Japan store have amiibo? Yeah, well, I can't remember if it was because of the amiibo or what, but I think that was the only way for me to get the special edition, and it came with the amiibo. Realness, you devil. I wouldn't sell it to you, Scott. I'm going to resell that bitch for like $55 at least. Okay, makes sense. Okay, I'm a little confused right now. Because it kind of looks like I don't have the blueprint. Oh, there it is. I didn't see it there. Here's what we're going to do. Trip. Wait, shit. That's not how I want it to look. Triple observatory. That's what all the enameled glass was for. Do you make silly decisions based on amiibo? I do. You're not wrong. Why can't I finish this? Oh, because I, I already built it. And now we can whale watch from out here. All right, the back to doing this shit. Keep going with the vertical connectors. Need more titanium. No, I don't. I lied. Now I need more titanium. No, I don't. Why is it? There we go. Okay. Let's get a bunch more titanium. Warning. Yeah, yeah. Of oxygen remaining. Can you power an amiibo with an iPhone? You probably could. Uh, but I, I care more about it because of the, the like the collector value. Get all this titanium out. Don't need gold. I can actually unpin a couple of these recipes. Put the vertical connector on still. Gonna need multi-purpose room soon. Need some hatches. Some observ an X compartment. Some more observatories. Okay. I wish Amiibo didn't actually do things in the game. Uh, why is that? Because they usually don't do much of value. Occasionally they do. Vital signs stabilizing. Breath of the Wild and uh, Zelda games come to mind. I actually think maybe, wait, if I go right here and swim straight up. Yeah, that's about actually where I want to be. Whale. Construct. 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 Construct again. Keep constructing. Uh oh, my AirPod died. I think I've seen people use an iPhone as an NFC rider to create the fake Amiibo cards. I won't lie, I, I have like one of those uh, chips. I forget what it's called. It's called like an N2 chip or something where you can read and write Amiibo data onto it. Uh, we're still good? No. Connect you, bitch. There we go. Let's go get more titanium. 
and quartz. I wasn't sure if you could do it with iPhones. Uh, you know, I'm honestly not totally sure either. I didn't do it with my iPhone. I used like a, the thing I have, it's like an, uh, a reader, a USB reader, basically. And it has like a little, it's like a circular chip, kind of. No more titanium in there. Should probably get some quartz out though. What else do I need quartz for? Oh yeah, hatches. Oh, but that only takes one. I know we have a shit ton of titanium in the waste crisis, which is somewhere out here. Right here. I'm just gonna fill up on titanium. Oops. This is why we brought all this titanium, so might as well, right? Hope this works. No power. Bullshit. We have been running the, uh, the Habitat Builder ragged. Yeah, I'm not sure you can use the phone as the Amiibo Direct. Yeah, uh, my guess would be no. I could be wrong about that, but... Take this out. Replace. Put this one back in here. Swim all the way up. Wait, did I finish this one? So you can't build the vertical connector out of there, apparently. Are we too close to the... Don't tell me we're too close to the lily pad. Kind of seems that way. Damn it. How annoying. Uh, let's see here. Let's see if I can get around this somehow. Alright, where did we put the connector at? Right there. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Always with the dangerous weather. Alright, we're gonna have to redo this a little bit, it seems. If I swim straight up from this one, would that make a difference? There's a whale in the way, but otherwise. And that would be that would come right up here. So what about right here? Poor planning is afoot. That might work. I guess we can only try it, right? Deconstruct. Do I even have inventory space to deconstruct all these? Nope. Not really. I'm so glad we moved our base over here, though, because the... Uh... Well, I am going to have to offload some of this stuff, though. All right, let's just offload a bunch of it so we can deconstruct all that. Do I have, like, any... Okay, this one's mostly empty. Okay. 
So now... What I'm going to try is to deconstruct this one and put a solid one there instead. Let me deconstruct all of these, actually. The problem is I built these Con these pipe connectors just a little too close to this lily pad above it. Oh, so vertical connectors can exist independently. That's interesting. way down and we can replace this one with a gl another glass compartment and it's building the eye compartment here and now we try building upwards from here wait can you build them anywhere no they do have to be connected at least originally if this doesn't work we're gonna have to build to the side a little bit or something. We don't want to kill this whale though. Is this going to build right up onto this vine? This whale loves hanging out right here. I hope he continues to, so we can... Oh, uh, it's going to come right up here. Damn it. Or will it? Not a titanium. Ah, the moment of truth, and it denies us. So we can? I'm not totally sure... Just right now, let me get some more titanium out. Can I build up from here? No, because it does hit the lily pad. Can I build an eye compartment. No, that's going to hit the lily pad too. If I'd come out just a little further, it would have worked. Okay, let's, let's try again. I think if we go back just one more spot, it might work. What are your plans for the whale if it sticks around? Enjoy its company. It doesn't seem to get... The whales in this game don't seem to get stuck on things. As much, anyway. So, I mean, the whole idea of why we built the base here... Why wouldn't it let me deconstruct that one? If I'm, my inventory's not full. It was so that we could enjoy the whale watching, so I actually kind of hope he sticks around. Now I can deconstruct this one. Build one more eye compartment. And start on the vertical connectors again. That's not right. Where do the little holes go? See, when I built the concept base, I just luckily happened to have a perfect positioning, kind of. So hopefully we can get that going again.
Dee dee dee. Let's deconstruct these other ones. I guess I, before I deconstruct all of them, I could confirm whether or not this is going to work. If it doesn't, I'm going to riot. Oh man, it's still close though. Oops. Apparently I'm out of titanium. I might have to extend, just extend out a little further or something. We'll see. Momentarily. It kind of looks like it's going to hit it in the same damn spot. Or will it? It might be just far enough away. Oh, it will let me do it there. Okay. So now, I'm going to build an eye compartment. That way. It's cold and scary out here. Not sure how I feel about it. All right, now we need more titanium and quartz. We're getting there. This time raw quartz, actually. All right, we actually emptied the, the waste crisis there. That's kind of cool that we got this glass pipe way. Uh-oh, we're out of power. Let's fix that real quick. I'm going to put it, next thing, as soon as we get the skeleton built, I'm going to put in the second bioreactor. Power is restored. Let's get this water as well, since it's here. We got any titanium in any of these or quartz? Here's some quartz. I'll take that. Plenty of titanium here. Go ahead and grab all of it. Put the gold back, actually. All right, so now, let me evaluate this here. It's stormy out here. Let's deconstruct this and face it the other way. Wait, you can, you can do a converter? You can put L compartments there? I didn't know that. That's cool. So let's put a multi-purpose room here then. Maybe. Connect it, damn it. Oh, wait. There we go. Let me up. Dangerous weather approaching. Always with the dangerous weather. We 
It's a little hard to get up on land, but... Let's go over here. Oh, it, it, it didn't connect, actually. Oh, that's a problem. What if I deconstruct it and build an eye compartment instead? Okay, that works. And then we want to build an L compartment here, probably. Do I have any glass left on me? I do, apparently. Do one more if I can. Oh, I need two glass still. Now let's go make that. Do I have any glass in the sea truck? Or quartz, I mean. So far, no luck. Eh, uh, I don't know why I thought we might. I do have some quartz on me. It's not what I intended it for, but... I'm having to improvise a little bit here. What about in here? There's some more quartz. When you need glass, you need glass. What are you going to do? <laughs> Fair point. Oh, we got a whole locker full of quartz here. Awesome. I was worried. Oh, let's only make two glass for right now. Oh, it's unpowered. The base is dying again. I just can't keep up. I might have to, like, in addition to the bio reactors, I might have to put some solar panels up or something. Whoops. Actually, didn't need that. Sorry, I didn't realize chat was quiet. I was looking into my intro sound. Oh. Wait, have you redeemed that? I can't remember if you redeemed it or not. No worries, Dan. One is capable of one. That's what I thought. Um, well, Dan, you know, you don't have to be the one to support chat, although it is very much appreciated. I try not to, I don't like putting pressure on my friends, you know? I did all that and then I didn't even make the glass. Go in here. Just make two glass for right now. Your bot puts pressure. Well, it's different, right? The bot is meant for the general, like just the general people hanging out in the chat. I don't like it that, I don't like it if you or Mark or uh, Dan or Waste or whoever else, or uh, Realness, I mean, or whoever else feels the pressure, like, to always be here, to always help me out, make it a good stream, you know. Again, super, super appreciated. Like, I don't know what I would do without you guys, but I think you get what I'm saying. All right, let's see. Can I build a hatch? I can. Amazing. As the whale comes up. Okay, this is actually turning out better than expected. It took a little finagling. The bot is nothing but trouble. <laughs> Make the bot tell jokes. My call is finally Sunshine. over. Oh, congrats, Corey. All right, so now let's go over here. 
We're almost done with the basic skeleton. Get up there. Come on. There we go. Jump. Jump. Thought I wasn't going to make that for a second. Can I do like a X compartment? Yep, that's exactly what I want. Right there. And now let's go get all our enameled glass out. Where did the hell did I even put that stuff? My hubby, are you going to work more tonight? Um, probably not. Here's some enamel glass. Two, three, four, five. Should have one more. One, two, three, four, five. One more somewhere. There it is. Much excite. <laughs> Figured whatever I don't get done before Sunday. Why is there random legs here? There's not even something to support itself there. That's odd. I guess I could build a foundation here. I want it to look less, more natural. I got a job for you and it blows. You're gross. Uh, I guess I, I can't really use that platform as it's being used for stability purposes. Dangerous weather approaching. See, so we can go inside here now, which is good. I don't know why I came here, though. Jump. Jump again. And now we can build another triple land-based observatory. Holy shit. Would you just look at that? Too bad you can't climb up onto the big lily pads. Oh, maybe you can. Directly? Apparently you can. I've had trouble with that before. All right, I think all the rooms of our base are built now. That's crazy. Or all the one attended ones anyway. Oh, look at that. I actually kind of like that we had to improvise with the piping to, to get to a lily pad, because now we can see the whales up here from up here. This room's going to need some work, of course. But then we also have a triple observatory up here. Just to look out at the whales, and... It's awesome. Okay. Uh, I need to build a ladder here, too. Do I still have the titanium? I should. Do I want it on this side or this side? Does it matter? Apparently, I can only have one choice. Down we go. Then we got the triple observatory here. To look out at water stuff, although I'm not seeing many whales here. Still a cool idea, though, right? all the way this way we get our scanner room and our control room of course we're gonna have to craft a bunch of upgrades before this becomes super useful what all can it sense already though eggs sulfur fragments galena copper calvarite argentine gel sac glow well i don't know why i would need to find a glow well limestone lithium quartz very neat and then over here is our control room, which we haven't been in one yet. So we have, it tells us the, the current time, which is uh, 3.05. So that's 
so it's late after, uh, mid afternoon kind of right now our structural integrity is 30 and then our power is 0% because we need to build another bioreactor the only thing that makes sense is to name it uh, how many characters do I get That's exactly how many characters I get. There we go. All right, so here are the base colors. White, red, light green, black. Um, and then with this thing, it pulls up like a mini map of your base where you can turn off power to certain rooms. How do I... You can move it this way. How do I like rotate it though? There we go. There we go. So I guess you could probably disable power to rooms you you don't necessarily need power to. So that's nifty. Are there any rooms I don't need power to right now? Is that another question? So if I go like here, whoops. All right, so I just turned off the scanner room because I don't need the scanner room right now. But does it tell me how much power a room is taking? It has to be. These have to be taking some, right? Okay, so that room is using power right now. And then... I guess I need the water filtration room to have power, and of course the bio reactor room to have power. I could turn off all these multi-purpose rooms right now. But I'm going to hold off. All right, we're going to need stripes. All right, I'm going to change all the base colors to something crazy. Just so I can tell what color goes where. Maybe. If I can figure out how to do this. We'll do, like, bright pink as the base stripe one will be lime green stripe I mean we're gonna make something hideous stripe 2 will be we're gonna fix it though um we'll make stripe 2 yellow and then the name can be Seek white of course I'm thirsty We'll take a look in a second. That sounds handy if they're sucking your mana. Exactly. All right. I got to piss again. I'll be back and we'll go take a look at this crazy ass gaudy base. So let's remember we made. Pink the base color, green strap one, yellow strap two, white name. Wow, look at this crazy environment we're in. All these islands, and then it looks like the heat vents are over here. Look at the whale. Whale! Whale sightings. How the hell do I get out of here? I'm gonna have to build more hatches eventually. Actually, that's going to be a priority pretty soon. The base looks the same color to me. We got to like do something to activate it. Oh, wait. It only did it these bottom. Why did it only do that? Those parts. That's odd. 
I mean, there's this weird glow on the rest of it. Okay, there's where the name went. On the scanner room for some reason. Can't move it, can you? Interesting. Let's... Oh, wait. That's blue. Why is that blue? The hatches need glass. They do, actually. Actually, I think the hatches just need quartz. Well, now it's blue down here. And this part's pink. I didn't say for anything to be blue, did I? Let's put a hatch right here, actually. Your downstairs glows with the brightness of a thousand VIPs. <laughs> What is this here? That's nothing. Oh, well, I think I actually want the base to be like a red color. Like maybe a... Not quite bright red, not quite like a maroon, but like a kind of darker red, kind of. Stripe one can be... Maybe like a deep blue, like that color. Shit, I messed it up. Why did it go back to base again? Oh, you have to actually click it. Okay. And then stripe one, we can make like a, like I said, the deep blue. Deep blue C. Stripe 2 could be like a dark gray, I reckon. We need to take this down a little bit. And the name can be bright red, I guess. And then we'll say done. Let's go take a look. See if it changed anything. Ew, it's dark out. It is odd that it puts the name on the scanner room. I think I actually want to deconstruct this hatch from right here. Move it over just slightly. Get our flashlight out. Okay. It actually took this time. Wow. Would you just take a look at it? I kind of love it. I might fiddle with it some more later. I think this is good for right now. I doubted the dark blue, but it works. And if you guys have some suggestions, I'm happy to take them. Because I just kind of came up with that on the fly. I kind of knew that I wanted the main color to be like a reddish color. But. Yeah. Okay. Now we need to start work. The whale is pushing my sea truck. That was rude, Will. I think the next thing we should do is build the uh, the bioreactor. The second bioreactor, that is. Which is somewhere down here. Because we're having power issues. Where's it at? T minus 20. Oh, boy. So that's going to take a wiring kit, titanium, and a loop. Good thing I brought some Welcome loop. aboard, Captain. Yep, 
here is nope that's an advanced wiring kit I know I brought some more I swear to god if I can't find another wiring kit I mean it's not a big deal because I got some silver light right over there somewhere let me check one more time I could have sworn we did all this already is the thing that's killing me. Maybe we used the wiring kit for something else. Not in there. Not in there. Let me check the sea truck. Because we know the lube's in the sea truck anyway. But do you guys like the general, um, I mean, we got some more work to do, but do you like the general, like, layout of the base and how it appears, both structurally and visually? Why does it not look red right now? Is that because it's not powered? It's looking great. Awesome. It seems like the color function might be a little buggy. Again, I'm on audio. I can't see it. Okay. Um, maybe it maybe it needs power and order. Well, this part's red, and it seems to be getting more red now. That's so weird. I don't get it. It's gonna be hard to top the base from our, from the first game that we made, but I know there's a loop somewhere in here. Really? It's not in the waste crisis, is there? Because I got three of them and we only needed one. Oh, here they are. I was about to riot. That would be an interesting effect if the uh, the colors were more was more prevalent based on how much power the base had. It's a weird lighting thing, it seems. Yeah. Oh, I didn't see a wiring kit either, so I'm gonna have to make that. There's some silver for that, though. And then we need to recommended. Yeah, yeah. Eat all the, the nuts. Vital signs stabilizing. In we go. Oh, we have voided all the titanium out of the prawn suit, so that's good at least. Good thing I, we're almost. Well, we're not quite almost done with needing it, but. Okay. Let's go ahead and make wiring kit. Since I did something with the other one. Let's go in. I'll probably build a hatch on that side too. Hatches everywhere. Hatches for everybody. Let's get our water out of here. You never have too much water. Let's build. Flip it around, please. Well, I thought I built it correctly. Flip it that way. There we go. And so now we can take a bunch of these fruits. Put some in here. And 
fill this one up as well. We'll see how that does as far as keeping electricity maintenance going. Who are you calling a fruit? You know who. Isn't this exactly where we had the multi-purpose room the first time around? I should probably go ahead and switch out the battery here. Because my uh, habitat builder is a uh, struggling here. Stick that back in there. Wait, I did that wrong. There we go. I mean, if we have to add some satellite panels to the top of the top of the base as well, that's not a big deal. So let's just see how that goes. Oh, they're full now, right? Nope, this one needs some. The, the power requirement right now is a thousand. I wonder what it was in the old place. Alright, we still got some quartz. Let's build hatches everywhere it makes sense to. Right here, for one. sides there. I, should, I don't need one there. And then we already built one on the top, so I think that should be okay. Alright. How, how am I on titanium right now? I'm gonna need, like, some more than that. Let's go back in. Give me all the titanium. Need more quartz too, if we're being honest. All right, so all these lock all these lockers are void of titanium. Let's remember that for right now. Let's see what? We and I think we got most of it out of the sea truck too. Oh, geez, we're gonna have to go on a titanium hunt, aren't we? Oh, here's some. Right, I was going to build some benches in the observatories, but with the amount of titanium that we have right now, I think that would be unwise. What are you making next? I was just going to go ahead and put benches in the observatories. But that's no bueno, I don't think, right now. Where will you rest your buns? That's a good point. I mean, we're going to do all this anyway. I may as well go ahead and put them in there. But we are going to run out of titanium before we're done. Bench, bench, bench. You know, I might actually turn... Uh, one of these observatories, not right now, but later, into a like a like an employee like lounge or rest area or something. A centered. We're gonna say it's centered. We can always move it. Nice view. Got some foliage. There's that one. Look at that. Oh, whale's clipping a little bit. You got this whale. 
I feel like I should go help him. <laughs> More benches. Oh, he made it. Good job, Will. Another thing that, to keep in mind is when you're sitting in an observatory, well, when you're sitting down, period, you don't lose food or hunger. It's not super useful, but it can be at times. I'm just setting just a song or something, but the music seems louder than it should be. Oh, I did crank it up a little bit. Back when we were on the screen. Okay, there's my benches built. In the observatories. Let's see, what else do we need to build here? Built the control room, built the filtration machine. Right, we need to get some batteries that can wait. Thanks for the hype. We already built a fabricator, a temporary fabricator, and a scanner room. We got the battery charger, we got the observatories. Alright, we're gonna need a bed. And that's gonna take uh a fiber mesh. Where's it at down here? For right now, I'm gonna build Danielle's bed. And the fiber mesh takes what? A crate vine sample times two. I don't have, oh wait, hopefully I remember to actually make one of these ahead of time. T minus eight, bench hype. <laughs> It'd be cool if it made the inside of your base the colors you picked too, but maybe that's hoping for too much. All right, uh, fiber mesh, fiber mesh. There's gotta be one in here somewhere. Actually, let me go ahead and put these other batteries in here. Oh shit, I didn't realize how late it was. Damn. Time flies when you're having fun. No fiber mesh in there. By the way, I do plan on creating a storage solution. It's just we don't have the one blueprint we need to make that happen just yet. Or I would have already done it earlier in the stream. Here's some more batteries. Any more in here? Let's go ahead and put some of these in here. Actually, I'll switch this one out with the full power. And I'll put this full power one in there. Or almost full power. Alright, still seems to be struggling a little bit power-wise. We may have to resort to putting in some solar panels. I mean, I really don't know what else to do other than shut off root power to every room we don't need right now, you know? Take this water. Maybe lantern fruit aren't as potent as they used to be. What was I doing? Okay, did I not find the fiber mesh? Oh, there it is. All right, so let's go build the bed. Having a bed in your, your base is going to be important. This is not going to be the permanent home for the bed. It's just, uh, I got to have one somewhere until we really like get down to like making our base pretty, if that makes sense. We'll just put it here in the middle of the damn floor. Look at this pretty bed. All right, that's done. Uh, all right, next we're going to do windows. To the window, to the wall, to the wall. And pin all. Where are my windows at? Down here. And that's going to take glass, which is going to take a ton of quartz. 
So I should really just get the rest of my quartz out that I have st stocked away here. And we can probably just go ahead and make windows out of all of that. Looked at the top five fields, none of them were lantern fruit. I guess benefit of that though is that you can grow it. Yes. What are the top five? Let's see. What was the, the top one in the, the first game? It was Reginald's, but I don't think Reginald's are in this game. Uh, glass. As much as we can get. Newt fish? Don't know what that is. Arctic. Oh, Arctic papers. Those are common. Boomerangs are common. Root pustules. Okay, that's good. And a penguin. <laughs> oh my god. I have a penguin. That's sad, almost. Alright, we got a shit ton of gl uh, glass for windows right now. Oh, it only takes one glass to make a window. Well, that's nice, at least. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay. We're just going to put windows everywhere that we can. Actually, let me take one more look at one thing. Eventually, for aesthetic purposes, I might build some glass... Um, compartments that connect the different rooms like kind of around the sides of the multi-purpose room or the the large rooms but that can wait that's that's extra you know seek fluid intake good thing i have a water filtration machine now vital signs stabilizing All right, now that we have that filtration machine going water has become less of an issue which is good windows one there. One there. You can't put them in the corners, which is unfortunate, but... One there. 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 Okay. I'm, put, I'm putting them basically everywhere you possibly can right now. I may have to put some more reinforcement somewhere, though. Based on... Because it looks like I'm going to run out of whole strength before I finish. Oh, I'm out, I'm out of glass. Okay. Go back. I know we had some more quartz. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. Throw them back. Cause I lose count. I wanna fly. It's time. Let me go grab that real quick. And we'll continue. Oh, Corey says he has it. All right, so we need to make sure we're catching some Arctic peepers and stuff for later. Interesting. The lighting is weird here. It's like the game doesn't know what to do with my base structure that I've created. Do I need quartz for anything I haven't already built? Uh... The fabricator, and I've already built the fabricator. The jukebox, that's going to be important. 
Now go ahead and build the jukebox. Thank you, sweetheart. Uh, to our bank. Almost done. Oh, cheers to that. Cheers. Cheers, everybody. Oh, yeah. So let's build the jig box. Which is somewhere in here. Here. I'll put it right in the middle for now, even though that's a terrible place for it. I won't start it yet, though, for uh, wastes purposes or sanity. And now we can go back to the sea truck. Build some more glass. Wait, that was the only thing I needed quartz for, right? Raw quartz, anyway. Yep, okay. Jukebox bribe money. Okay. <laughs> Plus. We're probably gonna have to go on a hunt for more quartz, too. Because this ain't gonna be enough, I can already tell you. Five? No way. Wah, 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 wah. I wonder if I could build some satellites on top of the main reactor, or the main room up there. Let's go. Alright, we made it over here last time. Window, 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 where are it at? Wait, why can't I? Is it because there's a, another wall here? It's weird that it even highlights that option then. That's fine though. I mean, I wouldn't want to look in here anyway, so. Okay, let's build one here, theoretically. Although that's not really a great place for a window. Yeah, I'm going to deconstruct that. I'll probably need to reinforce this eventually. Let's just remember there's a spot in one of the moon pools for reinforcement. for any more. And that's all the glass we have, because we have used every last one of our quartzes now. So I can go ahead and deconstruct this one. And remember that I need to put a reinforcement there. Alright, so there's probably, there's like space for plenty of more windows, actually. So we'll need to go on a quartz hunt. What else do we need? Built the moon pools, built the reinforcements. Large rooms are done. Jukebox. Got the shrub nut planted. Moon pools, battery charger. Control room, scanner room. Pot plants. We do need to build some grow beds. I 
How does it take to build a grow bed? Go ahead and put them up. Uh... Let's see. I know we're going to need jukebox speakers too. There's an indoor grow bed. I know we had this stuff for an outdoor grow bed because I've literally built them before. Where are it at? Apparently nowhere. I think another good idea would be to build floodlights that shine lights onto the base it, so it's kind of lit up at night a little bit, but that can wait. Okay, I feel like I'm going crazy. I'm not seeing exterior grow bed anywhere. You would think it would be in the same... There's interior modules, interior, ex, there it goes. Okay, I'm fucking blind. I can unpin window. For now, anyway. And we're gonna wanna pin foundation as well. What else needs to be done though? Jukebox speakers. Maybe a bulkhead, depending on how the window stuff goes. But that's it. Let's go ahead and build just the, like an indoor grow bed back here. 